guys, welcome back. My name is Sav if you're new. Today we are continuing our career legacy challenge, but I'm currently editing it right now and something really unfortunate happened. I lost, oh my gosh, I wanna say like three streams of this challenge. I don't know what happened, but I downloaded them for to edit later. I downloaded them from my, from my Twitch because that's usually how I do it is um, when you stream on Twitch, your broadcasts stay on your Twitch channel for a while. And um, usually what I do is I'll just download them to my computer and save them for later to edit. <sighs> three of them, three of them were something happened, some technical difficulties, I'm not really sure what, but I wasn't able to access the streams. I wasn't able to edit them and then I went to go like re-download them again and the stream had already expired because they expire after a certain time and they're gone forever. So unfortunately, a big chunk of this generation is gone, but I'm gonna try my hardest to uh, fill you guys in on what you missed. I have some clips because uh, there's another thing on Twitch where you can clip a stream. Anyone can do it. Anyone watching, the streamer can do it. Um, any of the viewers can do it. Uh, they're like little 30 second clips and they stay on your Twitch channel forever. So I was able to download those clips and include them in this video. So I, I'm just going to walk you guys through what you missed. Um, this might happen more in the future. I'm not really sure. It's very, it's a very tricky situation like downloading streams, streams from Twitch. Um, you can run into a lot of issues and uh, yeah, and the issue of them expiring as well. So I'm really sorry, I know it sucks. I was trying to figure out a way to like, not make this suck so bad, but really it just, it, it's just gonna suck regardless. So um, yeah, I just wanted to fill you guys in on that. And if it happens again in the future, just know that, you know, I'm sorry, I know it sucks. Um, but I'm gonna try my hardest to, uh, you know, let you guys know what you missed. Also, if you guys don't know, this series is a series that I'm doing on Twitch. And I wanted you guys on YouTube to, to be able to see it too. So, um, yeah, I usually just like edit down the streams, edit down all the extra talking and all the sounds and all that stuff. And I upload them as normal videos. So yeah, I just want to hop on here and tell you guys what's going on with that. Let's get into it, shall we? The last thing that you guys saw was Caitlyn kind of dating around. Um, she went, she was really liking this guy, Elijah. And unfortunately, so he was over one day and the fireplace in our bedroom started a raging fire. And he was the one and only victim. He went upstairs and started freaking out about the fire. He caught on fire. Our shag carpet caught on fire. Our closet caught on fire. Ignoring the fire. I didn't even have to. This is so stupid. This is so stupid. Yeah, it was just not a chill time. So um, my game <laughs> during this time was such a sh show. It had so many glitches, which you guys will see in a minute. No one bothered to extinguish it. So um, unfortunately, Elijah died in the fire. So after that, Elijah was out of the picture. So we started going on more dates. She met someone named Khaled at the bar and you know, they hit it off really well. They had amazing compatibility. She didn't think that he was that cute but the compatibility was there. And so we decided to marry him. We literally had the most chaotic wedding ever uh, <laughs> in true Sims fashion. Um, people were sitting crisscross applesauce in the, in the aisle. Um, you know, there was ghosts there. People were peeing their pants. It was just really bad. I'm kind of glad that you guys don't have to see that. Oh, he's right there. Someone's probably going to die. Probably, yeah. <laughs> 2 a.m. wedding day. <laughs> it is 2 a.m. What? What am I doing? I don't even know, bro. Our clone showed up, so that was fun. <laughs> Oh 
Oh man. Should we be friends with her? We married him. We ended up having three kids. Um, we had a set of twins and then we had a boy. What is happening? Like why? Why can't pictures just work? Oh my gosh, she's having the freaking baby outside. I, but, oh, caramba, at least there's a nice sunset. Look at that beautiful sunset. <laughs> well, here's your, your, your maternity picture. Gosh, darn. Uh, and this is where the glitches really started to rage in my game. This was around the time of the infant update, which was forever ago, I know, but uh, after that update, <laughs> every single child that I had, had this long giraffe neck glitch situation. No! I tried everything to fix it. I had this glitch for months. Um, I thought it was like a broken piece of CC, but you know, I used the Sims 4 tray importer to see what piece of CC was causing this, but nothing showed up. Um, I thought it was like maybe a mod that I had. I don't really know, but it took me forever to figure out what was causing this. Eventually I found out it was the remove EA lashes mod. <laughs> <laughs> which was the last thing I would have ever expected. I kind of like thought it was gonna be one of my cast sliders or something along those lines because of how like stretched they were. Like the lashes thing didn't even like, I didn't even think of it. But um, I ended up doing the 50-50 method with my CC where I took out half of it, tested my game, you know, and then just like trial, trial, trial of elimination from there. And yeah, that's what it that's what it came down to. So yeah, we deal with this glitch for many generations to come, um, but I finally get it fixed. So I just wanted to explain that to you guys as well. <laughs> so yeah, we ended up having three kids. They were all named after high-end designers. So we've got the twins, Vera and Vivian, Vera Wang and Vivian Westwood. And then we have one little boy, his name is Valentino. So where the stream picks up again is when I um, am just like sick and tired of the glitch and I end up aging them up into teens. You guys will see all of that. Yeah, all of this is super freaking frustrating. Like I feel so embarrassed, which I should, it's just like a really stupid thing. But I know that you guys are gonna, you know, be patient with me. I know that you guys are super understanding. Um, but this is the best way that I can figure out how to like make it as clear as possible for y'all. So you're not like completely confused. That's it from editing Sav. Let's just hop right back into the normal video, shall we? Thank you so much for listening to me rant about this. <laughs> like, look, this look at this floating head. I hate this. Oh. No! <laughs> this truly ain't it, Chief. Anyways, uh, so here we are back in the Orin household. Oh yeah, I forgot she was all shiny too. Too many issues. Too many freaking issues. Uh, in the last one, we aged up Vera and Vivian. We had our child, Valentino. We also had the worst possible Sims wedding you could ever imagine. And we went on a honeymoon and that's where we conceived this little guy. He's real cute. Them eyeballs, they're stunning. <laughs> Can you age up and then down? I did try that and it didn't work. Is this the EA, the EA glitch? I think, so. I think it might just be a mixture of things like CC and mods and um, just like all the updates and stuff. Uh, I don't really know, but every time I age up my kids, this happens. And it's just, it's not just my kids either. It's every kid in this save file in my game. So, I don't know. I need to figure out what it is, but I don't know how without taking out all of my CC. Maybe I should take this as a sign to purge, even though I really don't want to. Because it's going to take me 84 years. How many kids does this gen need? Three. We've had all three already. Okay, so age them up into teens one. So let's hop into Cass with them. So you guys think that we should age up Valentino as well? He's so cute though. Do you think it could be the skin detail? No, cause when I take everything off, she has no skin details on, no accessories, no clothes, no hair, no nothing. It's probably some random CC. 
that's the thing too. I uploaded them to my Sims 4 tray importer, which tells you what on them is causing problems. It tells you the exact piece of CC that is broken. But when I do that, nothing shows up. So it's gotta be something bigger than that, than just a piece of CC. <laughs> we gonna fix it right now. It sucks though, like, sorry. Sorry you're having your childhood stripped away from you. I think what we're gonna do is just age Valentino up into a toddler. Yeah, I don't know, this is all so confusing, but it's fine, it's not a big deal. Like, we do not follow the age rules. If there, there even, there aren't any age rules, but we age them, we age up our kids whenever we want. <laughs> whenever, it keeps it fresh and exciting. So I would do that too. Yeah, I think we're just gonna age them up to teens. Like, I, I'm, I'm just gonna do that. So let's start with Vivian first, since she's, uh, she's not broken. Wonder what that's like. But okay, are we ready to see their teen form? I'm super excited, actually. I think this is working out in our favor. Maybe they're just cursed. Don't say that! <laughs> New Stambilea. Oh! What's wrong with your eyes? What happened? You look nothing like your child! <laughs> I'm so confused. I- it looks nothing like her. Is it just me? What is happening right now? I don't think she looks like her dad at all. Like, nose? No. Mouth? No. Side profile? Not even close. Caitlyn? Maybe she has Caitlyn's nose. Something is just off here and I can't pinpoint what it is. I know there's something wrong with the eyes too. They're like, they're glitching. All right, we're gonna make it work. Oh. We're gonna we're gonna make it work. I don't understand why a Sims update would mess with your Sims face. Like, what's that about? Okay, I guess we're this is we're just gonna we're just gonna make it work, guys. We're just gonna make it work. Okay, so second trait for Vivian is going to be dog lover. All right, and. Vera's second trait is going to be gloomy, just like her dad. Okay. So Vera's a mu gloomy music lover. That's actually really cute. But none of those go with the next generation at all. Um, and her aspiration is Zen Guru. Dang. She's gonna write some good songs for real though. This doesn't make any sense. This doesn't make sense! Best-selling author, insider, and dog lover. And then we've got zen, guru, music lover, and gloomy. What's the next gen's career? Civil designer, or civil engineer. One of those. The one, the Evergreen Harbor one. All right, Vera. Oh, this looks really cute, actually. Um, so gloomy music lover. That's fun. I quite like that. I feel like she's gonna be very in her feels like all the time. Okay, she has, oh my God, are you kidding me right now? She looks like a freaking angel. Does she have purple eyes? No, Vera has blonde hair, brown eyes, and then Vivi has purple hair, blonde, purple hair, mm, purple eyes, blonde hair. This is really freaking cute, but her hair is way curlier than that. Oh my god, she reminds me of freaking Ginny from Ginny and Georgia. Her name's Ginny, right? Or is that Georgia? I can't remember. We could totally dye her hair a crazy color too. Oh god, this monochromatic yumminess of these two swatches makes my soul leave my body, I swear. This one is is captivating me. Which sim is this, by the way? I haven't been here since the start of the stream. That's okay. Uh, so this is our current heir's daughter. Um, she has a set of twins, and then um, a, blah, blah, blah. they're both girls, and then she also has a son. Um, we're required to have three kids this generation. Um, so yeah, I, I cannot freaking wait until we vote for the heir. All right, well... It is what it is. Um, let's see, I kind of want to give her. She's 
She's so cool. All right, Vivian. I think that you are going to be the opposite of your sister. I'm getting super preppy vibes. Anyone else? Look at lashes don't even fit on her eyeballs. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'm start I'm starting to see I'm starting to see her. I'm starting to see her child form coming through to be honest. Okay, baby, let's find you something to wear. I freaking love this hair so much. I've been waiting for a chance to use it. Oh my God. I actually kind of like this one. All right, let's give her some nails. She took way less time than her sister for sure. All righty, Vivian. Vivian. All right, let me pop open this wheel. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna spin it. And if it lands on, let's see this one. Yeah, look at that, fresh new scene for the wheel. If it lands on something that can happen in this gen, we'll do it. If it lands on something that had to do with that, uh, princess's gen. Man, we haven't spun this since princess's oh. gen, that's crazy. We went a whole generation without spinning it. No. Oh shoot. That's fun. Fall in love with one of your sims from past challenges. Ooh. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. So this has to do with the current air. So Caitlin, this girl. Who? Who? I like this. This is good. Does Elijah count? No! <laughs> That's not a past challenge. That was current challenge. Charlie, Ren, Bud or Thorn, one of the Missing Weatherhood babes. Um, Casper from 100 Baby. <gasps> I love that. I love that suggestion. We love Casper in this house. Okay, I'll just put someone from Big Brother. If you guys have a suggestion that you can remember. Casper it is, that's exciting. All right, um, last but not least, we have to age up this little babe um, to an infant. I mean, a toddler. Oh, so cute, oh my God. All right, we got blue, blue, this is swimwear. You can have, let's see. Let's do those, party wear. Look at our little guy. I'm obsessed. He's so freaking cute. <laughs> we are done. We are done in cast. That was a lot. That was a lot. Still a little bummed about Vivian's eyes. I really hope that they fix the glitch soon. Let's see if Khaled looks the same. Yeah, we already checked. He looks fine. Caitlyn also looks fine. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. So what's for next stream? Gameplay. We should uh, randomize Vera and Vivian's sexuality right now as well. We also need to build their bedrooms now. <sighs> oh, there's so much to do. We like fly through this challenge, which like makes it kind of hard because, um, yeah, it's just like a lot to do in such a small amount of time. Um, okay, let me go to my sexuality generator here. So, let's pull that down there. Okay, so this is going to be for Vera. I should probably write this down. Ooh, Vera's gonna be lesbian, that's fun. All right, I definitely get those vibes from her. Okay, so Vera's lesbian, Vivian is going to be Great. Okay, cool. That actually aligns very, very, very well with what I had in my mind. <laughs> oh man. So we're gonna develop preferences. We're gonna do random. We'll do moderate strength. All right, let's have a look. Let's have a look at and see what they're interested in. Feminine appearance. She likes human occults. She doesn't like ghosts. Okay. She likes 
Salt and pepper hair. Oh my god, is she into older guys? Dark blue. Blonde. Okay. Salt and pepper, blue and blonde. She doesn't like... Oh, she doesn't have any dislikes about hair. She likes long hair. Curly. Long curly hair. And she doesn't have a preference about uh, facial hair at all. She likes black eyes, green eyes, and brown eyes. Tattoos and body hair. And she doesn't like freckles. <gasps> Legas. No preference on body weight. High body muscle. Okay, she likes buff, guy buff girls. She likes black clothes, yellow clothes, orange clothes, red clothes. So she likes warm colors. She likes polished style. Interesting. She doesn't like- she doesn't have a preference on dislikes. Okay, and then she likes hats, jewelry, and piercings. So she likes piercings and tattoos, a polished style, a lot of muscle. Okay, what do you- what is this from? That was it. Big deal. Vivian's been doing that for years from watching Sibling Milestone. Oh my god, get over yourself. Masculine appearance. She likes human sims and dislikes ghosts as well. Same as her sister. She likes brown, dark brown, auburn, and red. Dark brown, auburn, and red hair. No dislikes. Uh, long hair and bald. It's all or nothing with this girl. Okay. Uh, straight hair and wavy hair. She likes clean shave or beard. All right, it's really all her- Um, she likes gray eyes, aqua eyes, and brown eyes. Low body muscle. Okay, she likes some scrawny guys. Scrawny guys with beards. I bet she's gonna like a hipster style watch. Bohemian. Okay, she likes a boho guy. All right, boho it is. Sounds Gucci. Okay, Goyles, well. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today, guys. Uh, make sure to join the Discord as well uh, to keep up with announcements of when I'm gonna go live next. I usually make an announcement like a couple hours before I go live. I love you guys so much. Take care of yourself. Treat yourself. Love yourself. I'll see you very soon. Bye.